Hey fans, uh, this is the video to do with um, gluing bark onto your notepad. Um, the re reason why I wanted to choose trees is that because um, of my anxiety I, I often find walking through the woodlands or forests very relaxing. We actually saw waterfall with the friends today and um, yeah it just really helps to soothe me and it's just generally a beautiful sight to see. I always find nature to be so inspiring. So first of all I bought a recycled notepad from WH Smith so it's 100% recycled. And what I've done, I have start. I wanted to try a little bit first just so you know I knew what I was doing basically. Um, so this is this um, bark we got here, a friend of ours owns a forest so he kindly um, let us have some bark. So again all, all natural. And it, um, yeah, so it, it actually came straight out of a log as well, um, a log that um, me and my friend actually um, physically took off ourselves, so, so there's a bit of a story behind that as well. And, um, and they want to use the wood to, you know, help people grow. Um, and also um, got our PVA glue, our um, strong PVA glue. And also, I was told by a friend that um, um, uh, that rapeseed oil or linseed oil can help stop the wood from cracking. So, I mean, I have had to break it up a little bit to fit on the notepad. But then, you know, once it's on, the, again, the notepad, again, just let it dry naturally. Um, you know, that, that should stop it from breaking any further, basically. So without any further ado, I've got so I'd say I've got some pieces, a um, bit of a blue peter. This is what I did earlier. So um, so we're gonna pop a shared load of glue. As I said, this <laughs> you probably noticed that I really don't care if I get messy. You probably noticed that I ju I just don't care really. So we're just gonna um, just literally lather it with uh, glue. So we got our first piece here. Now I might, because the, um, obviously naturally from a tree, you know, it's going to be hollow, so you will have to press it down. So, you know, which, because obviously, you know, trees are hollow, aren't they? So, I don't know if you can hear the crack as I do it. <laughs> Probably heard that then. So you can so, so push down hard. As I said, the um, it is going to take quite a long time to dry. And again, we put a bit of um, linseed oil, Jen, just to sort of condition the wood. As I said, like you, like I said, you probably noticed, I just don't care for mess. Um, I really don't. Um, so basically, we just keep on adding the pieces on. So, as I said, just smother the glue on. Just absolutely smother it on. Because, I mean, what's the... I mean, you know, I don't think you can ever have too much glue when you're actually gluing a lot of stuff. Again, you can hear the crack. <clears throat> you might have to put just a little bit more glue around the edges. It doesn't matter if you cover the tree because that's all going to dry, so dry off. But it might just help to glue it in place. And it helps if you don't have stick. So it's best to wipe your hands as you go along as well because otherwise, as you see, it's just all going to stick to you, basically. So we'll keep on going. So like I said, just keep, just keep uh, gluing that on. Like I said, this is definitely an experiment because as I said, I don't know, I don't know how well this is going to glue, but it's always, it say it's worth it because, but if you, you know, if you don't try, you don't know. Okay, so we'll do a few more pieces, I think. Oh. Oh. 
really cool in here. Yeah, like I said, it's not it's not really gluing the best. I'm not gonna lie. Um, but so I think we'll have one more bit there. Seed oil has seemed to have helped the other side. Oh, well, that's rapeseed oil, but you can use either. I think it's that thing, just keep pushing it down every so often as well. Keep, keep pushing it down. top yeah yeah I don't think I'd be as I said this I think it is going to take more thought but as I said at the end of the day if I don't try I don't you know, I don't learn from what I should do and what I shouldn't do, basically. Because yeah, so nice. obviously this, it still needs to close. <sighs> okay. I think it's about enjoying the journey, isn't it? As you say, having it a is, go. It is, yeah. It's definitely about enjoying the journey, having a go. It's, you know, don't, you know, as I said, you know, don't worry if it doesn't work the first time. It's like, you know, just keep on trying it, you know. Until, until you do get it right, until you do find a way. Because, um, you know, you, you learn so much more then. Okay, guys, so I think we're going to leave it for there. And, yeah, again, I want to thank you for listening to the channel. And um, I sh will, show, will show you the results of how this turned out to be. And um, so, yeah, and as I said, keep positive and keep on experimenting. Bye.